Hold on one second. Oh, there we go. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. 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 Welcome in, guys. Hope you're all doing so good. Hopefully, you can hear me now. No audio. Guys, I know. I know. I saw. I saw. I fixed it. Hello. Welcome in, everyone. Hope you're doing good. I'm so excited to be here. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Um, today, today, I'm tired. <laughs> I'm tired. You ever just tired? I'm all sleepy, but I'm excited to be here. Today, we're gonna be live reacting to the Indie World 2020 Showcase. In case you've never seen one of these before, it'll be my first time live reacting to them, um, to this one specifically. And it's gonna feature a lot of new upcoming Switch indie games, which is really exciting. I really like indie games. I think it's a great way to support smaller developers and also I tend to find that there are a lot of cute cozy games that come from indie developers um in case you're new here in case you've never seen me in your entire life hi my name is Pete and welcome to Pete's Corner I am a variety cozy gamer and streamer I love all things cozy and so even though music's much louder than my voice what am I now um even though I only play cozy games we'll still react to everything that's not cozy I'm wearing my Ooblet shirt today in honor. Shout out to Jen for gifting from Throne. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, yeah, I'm really excited and I'm hoping there are gonna be some cute, cozy games. One is the direct in 20 minutes. In 20 minutes. It is at noon. Um, let me, before I get started, I like to let my friends know that I I'm chronically ill and cute. I like to let my friends know I have a chronic pain condition so I can be my most comfortable self during my streams. I want you to be your most comfortable self during the streams. That's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna say hi to everybody. But first, just a reminder, right after this stream, well, at 1 p.m., so this one might end slightly before that, um, I'm gonna be streaming back to back. So we're gonna play some more Lonesome Village today. So stay tuned for a double feature. Let me say hello to everyone and then let's go ahead and we'll get started. Aubrey, hello. Emerald, hello. Jess, hello. Abigail, hello. Allison, hello. Alyssa, hello. Emerald, hello. Linda, hello. Hank, hello. Sarah B, hello. What is up? John, hello. Lilium, hello. Welcome in. Carefree, hello. Becky, hello. Care Bear, hello. Gothrock, hello. Hope you're doing good. Tab, hello. AJ, hello. Kuridun, hello. What's up, what's up? Did I say hi to Hank already? Hank, hello. Wanderer, hello. Koi, hello. Danny, hello. Chaos Chrissy, hello. Jess, hello. Punch, hello. Kira, hello. What's up? What's up, Victoria, hello. Hope you're doing so good. Hope you're all doing great. Do you see my little animal around in the back? You see the little animal in the background? There's a little animal. Tony, hello. Kathleen, hello. Lindsay, hello. Welcome in, guys. I'm so excited you guys are here. Let me switch over to this. Wow, look at this lovely screen. Hold on one second. <laughs> Inception! Oh my god. Okay, this is the this is the real one. Here's what I want to do. Here's what I want to do. We're gonna stop the cute little lo-fi beats. And I'm gonna test the audio. So I want to see, I want to make sure that it's going to be a good level so you guys can hear the actual direct, but still hear me. So I pulled up the last Nintendo direct just as like an example for volume. So let's just test really quick. I just want to make sure, just let me know how the volume is compared to me, okay? Also, I can't hear it. Hold on, wait. Is YouTube muted? Oh no, my headphones are muted. Ha ha ha. All right. How is, how is this game volume in comparison to me? It's pretty good? Be honest, is it too low? Does it need to be louder? Is it too loud? Sounds good, you can hear it, but you can hear me. You want it a little louder. It's a little low. How's that, better? Is that better? You're awake. You're awake. You're really awake, yeah. Is, was that any better or no? Let me know. How long this is me ha after having what moved it. Yes, that's things. better. Better. Better, better, better. Okay, cool. I think, yeah, it's better. Perfect. Perfect. Tiny bit louder. Okay. I'll, I'll put it a tiny bit louder, but I think we'll be good. All right. Cool. I'm so excited. I have no speculation. I'm not cool enough to know what to speculate here. I don't really know that much. I'm, I'm like new to the 
the gaming, right? I'm new to the cozy gaming. I'm new to the gaming. So I don't really know what the heck to expect. When you're watching my reaction to the direct, you're coming at it from someone who knows not that many things. This is almost like a true audience reaction. I don't know that much about a lot of the games. I mean, maybe I do. Maybe I know more than I think now. But anyway, I always like to give just kind of like the the audience reaction. The, we give the audience reaction. I hope they put Dinkum on Switch. I'm sure they will. It was so wildly popular. I feel like, why wouldn't they? I don't care. I just want to see something cozy. Speaking of cozy, oh, my dog ran away. I had like the perfect opportunity to scoop up my dog. The perfect opportunity to scoop up my dog, you know? Didn't happen. Didn't, it didn't happen. Didn't happen. Um, but what are, are there any titles you guys are looking forward to? Is there anything you guys are speculating? Is there anything you guys are speculating? I want to know. They will most likely put a Dinkum on Switch once it's not in early access. Yeah, for sure. You're not late, BF Animal Crossing. I didn't even start yet. You're good. But also on that note, yeah, the developed, the developed, I'm like 99% sure wants it on Switch. Oh, the developer, yeah. But it's still in early access. Yeah, for sure. It's like Coral Island. You won't see Coral Island in this today. <laughs> Hi, just came home from work. Uh, forgot that you're going live. I am. You have in Link that you play Stardew Valley. I have in Link I play Stardew Valley. Yes. <laughs> I'd love if Traveler's uh, Rest could go on Switch. It's still in early access, though. I'm unfamiliar. I know there's one game that a lot of people are excited about. It's called, like, Silk Song. I've never heard of it, but I, I've whenever I've clicked on this direct, the whole tra chat is like, Silk Song. I don't know what this is, but perhaps we'll see it. <laughs> Maybe we'll see it, and we'll give our opinion on based off of nothing but the trailer I feel like you can trailers really gotta sell it like I feel like at this point I've watched so many game trailers I gotta be sold I gotta be sold the Hollow Knight sequel yes I'm unfamiliar with this but I've heard it is very popular and very anticipated specifically for today so we'll see what this is about We'll see what this is about. I'm excited. Yeah, so we still have, like, another 15 minutes, but I wanted to give us some time to just chill before. I don't want to just jump right into it. Um, I know it won't be out till next year, but since the demos are available at conventions, maybe Oxenfree 2. Mmm. We never know. We never know. We never know. We never know. Hollow Knight is a platformer and super fun. See, I'm new here. I don't know all the stuff. Feliciana, hello. Welcome in. Kaylee, hello. Welcome in. Are you on the Silk Song Club? Do I need to look this up? Do I need to look this up? Do I need to look this up? Do I need to be in the club? Do I need to be in the club? Because all of the comments on the actual, like, Indie Direct Live are about this. <laughs> They're all about this? Is it cute? What does it look like? Is this cozy? Can we find coziness? It looks dark. It looks dark in a cozy way. Is that an accurate description? It looks dark, but in a cozy way. A spooky kind of cozy. Not everything needs to be cozy, but I like it that way. Not very cozy. It looks like a spooky little cutesy, though. Spooky cutesy. Saying hi from work. I can I can stay for a bit on break at the moment. I hope you enjoy your break. Dark in a cozy way sounds great, right? I feel like it's not your style. Probably not. <laughs> I like to farm. I like to collect ooblets. I like to design. I like things. I like things. Dark, spooky, cozy would be cool. I like a dark, spooky, cozy. There's nothing wrong with a dark and spooky, cozy. That's a good combo, I think. I think. Also, remember how I said... <laughs> so we're playing Lonesome Village in the stream right after this, and I was like... Guys, I can't stream it until I find the turtle, just in case I do a half- I have to do a whole stream where I'm looking for the turtle. I still didn't find the turtle, but we're gonna send it. We're gonna just send it. I think I have Hollow Knight, but I think I haven't played it. Fair. Fair. Fair, fair, fair. Collecting all the games. <laughs> I also really like the little logo. I like the little light bulb for the indie. It's kind of giving me, like, cute little- Cute little creator vibes. It's giving cute creator vibes. Is my dog still in here or did he leave? No, he dipped. Okay. Gotta collect them all. 
You gotta get all the oobs, you know? They announced Ooblets 2 today. Ooblets 2. They just keep on oobin'. Keep them oobin'. 10 out of 10 would recommend art, character, story, and music all amazing. Well, I will have to check it out if it's coming Switch. Like the game version of Pixar. We like that. I mean, isn't, isn't that just Disney Dreamlight Valley then? <laughs> game version of Pixar. There's only, what, like two Pixar characters though? Does it count yet? Does it count yet then? Does it count yet? That I don't know. Also, if you guys haven't already liked the stream, please be sure to do that on your way in. I know it's like, you wouldn't think it's a big deal, but liking the stream is the coolest thing you could do. Other than subscribing, which we're almost at 5.9k, so thank you so much. I would love to see a surprise Haunted Chocolatier trailer. I would scream. I would scream. You would get hate and screaming. I would absolutely love that. There's been no hint of a date for that one, right? So that would be like total, total craziness if that were to happen. If you're unfamiliar, the developer who made Stardew is making a chocolatier version. There's like a big chocolate factory. Well, here's an advance warning for the headphone users. Here is an advance. I'll put the microphone farther away. I realize I don't need the microphone this close to me because I yell. I yell, but then you're closer to the fan and I don't want it to, I don't want it to get the fan too much for my streams just don't ever wear headphones <laughs> you never know what could happen you never know what could happen i want to see something weird you know what i want to see i want to see so something that's cute and i want to see something strange i want to see something that is so weird that we're into it like give me the weirdest little game you got i got my iced coffee i'm gonna make my coffee before my next stream I did not have enough time, so we grabbed, not sponsored by Poppy, but if Poppy wants to sponsor me for the little sparkling prebiotic soda drinks, you can, because I'm a, I'm a little addicted to you. I'm a little, I'm a little, I like them. They're good. They're expensive, though. They're expensive, but I justified it because I'm like, they're healthy. They're healthy. Making my coffee right now. I just got like a hundred pack of my K cups and I do this like variety pack with like fun flavors. However, there's like two flavors that aren't my favorite. So for the past couple months, I've run out of all of the good flavors and now I just replaced it. So now all the good flavors are back. The blueberry vanilla is back. There is a coconut cream one. Yummy. <gasps> my dog came just in time to pay us a visit. Hold on. Hold on one moment. Hold on one moment. Dexter, are you excited to see the indie games? Do you think Dexter is excited to see the indie games? I don't know. I think he's a... Oh, do you want to not fall? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Sit. Sit your booty down. Sit your booty down. I want Dexter Simulator. That's what I want. Dexter Simulator. Can someone make the Dexter game? Dexter, do you want to look at them? Do you wanna, he's like, no. He's like, no, mommy. Oh, sorry, I kicked you. He's like, no, mommy. <laughs> he said, I'm camera shy. He said, I'm shy. He said, I'm shy, but I wanted to see the games. He said, I didn't come for you. I came for the games. In a way, he's kind of like a sloth. Like, look how he just, like, he just goes, you know. You just go. Do you just go? Do you just go? <gasps> yes. Yes. Dexter has um, really strong commentary for the games we're about to see. He's really excited to give you some strong commentary. He's so fluffy. I want to hug him. He's always, he's so fluffy. He is just, he's at his happiest fluffy though. Like, whenever we've given him like haircuts, it's not the same. It's not the same. Dexter helped me save money. Dexter is not the one to help save money. Dexter is an expensive little princess. Wednesday, hello, welcome in. Can we have a Dexter emote? We're like 150 members from another emote, but <laughs> when we get there, yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> right, buddy? Right? Okay, are you, are you comfy here or no? He's giving me the look. He's giving me the look and I can't tell what's in his eyes. Joy or absolute distress? Are you joyful or distressed? 
We got nine minutes, so you gotta make up your mind. You gotta make up your mind. His little face is so cute. He does have a tiny little face compared to all of his fluff. Like, he is just a big pile of fluff, and then there is tiny little snoot. Right? You got a tiny little snoot. You got- what if I turn my chair? Then they'll be able to see you. Oh, look! Oh, look, they could see you now! Oh, look, they could see you now! This is the most you've ever seen of Dexter's face. <laughs> Dexter, what's that? What is that? This is literally the most you've ever seen of his face, because he never show he never faces this way. <laughs> anyway, welcome to my Dexter stream. He's got your face. He's got your face. Yes. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. You're a very good boy. <laughs> he just gave such a look. He's like, can we just get the direct started? No, you have to wait eight minutes. The colors are beautiful on him. I, and the thing is, so, we love, he's a toy Australian Shepherd. We love Australian Shepherds. We always have. We always wanted one. Well, we wanted one for a while. And originally, we thought the blue Merles, oh, I went out of focus. Sorry, come back. Okay. Um, we wanted the blue Merles, because we thought those were the most rare. Those are, like, the gray ones that have, like, black little spots. And we just kept seeing them everywhere. Like, every place we would go to look for Aussies, we always saw the gray ones, and we saw the black tri ones. We never saw ones like him, and he is a red tri. And when I saw him at the pet store, he was also, like, on sale. <laughs> we weren't even, like, going to get a dog that day. We just happened to, like, see him, and we're like, oh, he was on sale? And I was like, wait, but he's the cutest one. He's the cutest little boy. And ever since, we never see, we don't see that many that look like him that are the red tri Aussie. There are tons of them, but for some reason over here in the city, I never see any. Never see any. You forgot to mention you, your merch shift? Oh, I hope you enjoy it. I can't wait to see how everything looks. Hope you enjoy it. But yeah, he's a, he's a toy Aussie. He's a very good boy. I will put you down. I will put you down because I will probably be moving during the reaction. But thank you. You say... Thank you for letting me say hi, everybody. You say thank you for saying hi, and thank you for watching my mom's stream. <laughs> thank you for watching my mom's stream. Hope you enjoy it. Okay, I'm gonna put you down. Um, oh, I know. Oh, okay. <gasps> See, it's better, because you know, now you're on the ground, and you don't have to be nervous. You're on the ground, and you don't have to be nervous. Bucket, 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 hello? What's up, what's up? That was just your nice little Dexter break. Nice, nice to pass the time, you know? He deserves all the treats. I'm gonna give him a bone later. He has, he was having some like hot boy tummy issues the past couple days, but I think he's feeling better, so he probably will get a bone later. I actually forgot that the indie world was happening. I got you. <laughs> I got you. I got you. It's happening in six minutes. You work at a vet clinic and rarely see red try. 70% are blue Merle. You have a cool rare boy. Oh my god, thank you. And then, yeah, it's so weird. I, I would have thought that the red try would have been just as common as the black tries. But I haven't seen them any. And then if I ever see them, like, on TikTok, like, TikTok seems to know I have an Australian Shepherd. I always see, if I see a red try, I see a full-size Aussie. I never see little ones like him. Except I did see one once that was literally his doppelganger. And I was like, is that Dexter? What are you expecting to see on the direct? I don't care, as long as there's one game that's really cozy, and there's one game that's really weird, but I like it. That's it. Expectations are low. The good thing about me having no knowledge about upcoming games is I'm not disappointed <laughs> when I don't see something. I mean, I think I might have some knowledge, but not really. Not really. Your dog, is a, your dog is a Jack Russell. I love Jack Russells. They're really cute. I think I know at least one game. Is it the silk one? Is it the silk one? Mina, hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Your dogs are Dachshunds. I love Dachshunds. They're so cute. Can we get Dachshund Simulator? I want to see Dachshund Simulator. I want to see a farming game, a cute puzzle game, and something weird. A farming game, a cute puzzle game, and something weird. That's what I want. That's what I want. Will there probably be some, like, RPG fighty things? Yes, and that's fine. That's fine. I want something farming, a cute puzzle, 
Something weird. Virtual hangout. Hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. <laughs> it's not indie, but we need to... No, Nintendogs would be, like, its own thing. Nintendogs would be, like, a severe, ginormous, crazy announcement. Crazy announcement. Oxen free 2 news would be great, but as long as there's a cozy game or a platformer, I'll be happy. Yeah, for sure. Peyton, have you heard of Harmony's Odyssey? I have heard of Harmony's Odyssey. I didn't try it, but I did I did hear about it, and I always would see it in the eShop when I was doing my little scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. I need a new home for my virtual corgi, right? I know, what's up with that? Omar, hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. What is up, what is up? I want Ooblets too. Keep keep on oobin. I want Ooblets the sequel. Marla, hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Imagine two blitz. <laughs> Not two blitz. I hate it. I love it. Make it happen. Two blitz. Ooblets two electric boogaloo. That. That's what I want. <laughs> Ooblets two, but now. You can romance people. You can romance Inaba and Padrig. And you can have little ooblet babies. Perfect. Sounds good. I'm in. I'm in. <laughs> Sign me up. Sign me up. I want, you know what else I want? I want like a sad game. I want a game that's going to make me cry. I want a sad game. Can we get a fit check? Ooblet's t-shirt. The same white beret I wear in every stream now, apparently. Apparently, I don't wear the black beret anymore. And the same leggings I always wear. But you can't see those. <laughs> Ooblets. All the oobs. All the oobs. Pay wants all the feels. Yeah, I want a game that's gonna make me cry. I'm gonna play Spirit Fair, but I probably will do it as a members thing. That's actually on my... We're doing a member stream on Saturday night. Um, and we're gonna play a new game. I don't know what we're gonna play yet, but it's gonna be a shorter stream. So I don't know if I want to dive into that one on that stream. We'll see. There is another new game, though, I am gonna be playing on my channel this week, though. The sass about the leggings. I wear the same leggings every day, and you don't need to see them. You don't need to see how covered in Dexter hair they are, frankly. Oh my god, it's about to start, by the way. May, hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. What's up, what's up? I'm like, oh yeah, we're doing something. We're here for a reason, right? It's not just me vibing just a vibe. It's not me just talking about my dog and ooblets. <laughs> things things are gonna happen. My mom's dog is a Pembroke Welsh Corsi, Corgi Peekaboo mix, but looks more like a Pembroke Welsh Corgi. That's so hard to say. Pembroke Wel Welsh Corgi. You know? Watching from... Oh my god, I can't talk today. Watching from work, so lurking. Enjoy your lurk. Literally me at home with my leggings. No one needs to see me with my husky and cat hair. No one needs to see me. No one needs to judge me. All right, I'm gonna do a nice little refresh. I'm gonna do a nice little refresh. All right. We got nothing. We got nothing. We got nothing. Oh, okay. Great. Here we go. And you let me know how the volume is. I'm so excited! Let's go! I like the music. Let's go. Hello. Hello. And welcome to Indie World. I'm Mariko. And I'm Tyler. Do you want captions on or off? With a showcase full of indie games headed to the Nintendo Switch system. I don't want them to say anything Let's inappropriate. Dive right in. Volume's good? Okay. Let's dive in. <gasps> it's something cute. It's something cute. This is cute. This is cute. What's this? Okay, we're making fish. Volume up a tad. Got it. Okay, cooking sim? I'm into it. Do we get to cook? Are you gonna teach me how to cook? I love the music. Yeah, very cute art style. Ooh, what do we got going on here? Very pretty art style, yeah. Thank you so much for subscribing, James. Thank you so much. I realize I don't have the alert box on. I'm Sue. And I'm Sharon. We're making a cooking game called Venba, which is about an immigrant Indian mother and her family coming to Canada in the 80s. 
Aww. Food often acts as a bridge between assimilated children and their immigrant parents. So we wanted to use cooking as a lens to tell the story of this family as they grow and change. I love we that. We often see the kids' side of these stories, but as we ourselves got older, we thought telling the parents' side might make I like their cat, by the way. perspective. And we hope you find it interesting, too. I love Fun that. and enjoy the show. It looks so good. Mm, the food looks delicious. It smells delicious. Grab a spoon and get a taste of this wholesome narrative cooking game. Help an Indian mother who is yeah, doesn't recently the food look so good? Reconnect the cat the made the game. Yes, the cat a is a paid model. Watering South Indian dishes. Oh, that looks Experience so good. A story of love and loss through branching conversations. Okay, perfect. Try we got something cute and a little sad recipes, right off the bat. Love it. Belong to a soundtrack inspired by Indian musicals. I love it. I, ooh, an appetite, inspired by Indian Venba, musicals. Coming to the I love Nintendo that. Switch system. Venba. I like it. Ooh. All right, start off. What's this? Cute. to make a game? Yeah. But it's a lot harder than you might think. Just Cute. ask Kani'i and Kumade, two friends striving to find like the it. perfect idea for their next game. Is Watch it a game about making develop a game? A game about a game? Stages of a retro-inspired puzzle platformer while following oh, it's like Inception. struggles. The recent games haven't exactly been raking in profits. So both of them Gray, hello, welcome part -time in. jobs to Brooke, make hello, ends in. meet. Will their friendship oh, this is cute. It's like a game challenges? about making a game. Find out when Goodbye World launches on Nintendo Switch. That's kind of cool. Later this month. Yeah, I like that retro kind of thing. That's kind of cool. Is this your cute spooky thing you all want? Is this the cute spooky thing you all want? No. What is this? Have a nice death? Cute spooky? Okay, we got a cute spooky. Spooky spooky. I'm okay with- oh my god, alright. <laughs> I'm okay with fighting things if it's cute. If it's cute, Mercedes, hello! Uri, hello, welcome in, hope you're doing good. I like that we're like the Grim Reaper here. Spooky platformer, I'm into it. Cute! He's giving me like- he's giving me a cute little Grim Reaper. Have a nice death is a nice title. I saw someone play this, it looks I'm fun. It's cute! I'm dying to play this one. It would be a grave mistake Dying to, to play, it. but I'm- Don the Robes of Death Incorporated CEO, Death himself, in this grimly charming roguelike game. It cute! Looks like you're oh my god! <laughs> Not that guy so having a knife in his head, yikes! You alright? There are 70 wicked weapons Hopefully not a grave decision. spells <laughs> at your disposal. All of which can be upgraded to create devastating combos as you hack and slash your way through the corporate underworld. I love it One being a corporate being underworld. Is that, well, you can't die. So use what you Never saying have a nice day anymore. Nope. No nice days allowed. And bosses. Reap what you sow. When the death Halloween puns are death cute. Slashes onto Nintendo Switch March. March. I feel like pre-orders begin. Halloween today. might have been a good time to drop this one, but whatever. It's death all year, apparently. Hello. They have a red panda plushie. Hi, I love you. Do you have a red panda in your game? Magical world. I'm in. En effet, après avoir grandi avec des films d'animation traditionnels des années 90, il était naturel de dessiner un monde luxuriant, organique et peint à la main, avec une histoire Hand qui, je l'espère, vous touchera. Merci. 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 Is there anything better than relaxing in nature and enjoying the gentle oh scenery? Oh my gosh. What about doing it was intentional. I love it. While lying on top of a giant capybara? In this small open Shut up. Game, you have <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. Shut up! Inner peace on an isolated island paradise. As the retired warrior Akka, explore handcrafted islands covered in majestic mountains, dense tropical forests, and inviting hot springs. Gorgeous. Spend your time here um, however you'd like. Not an Nurture open world red panda home, game? Shelter, <laughs> what? Items, or feed these adorable baby dragons. Or Shut up. <laughs> go on quests to meet mysterious characters, friendly giants, Look and at the face bee! the of your past. Literally. Oh, Aka I like the ghost! Is up on Aka! Switch, December 15th. That's not that far away! Merry Christmas! Oh, love that for us. Okay. Hello, I like your hair. Yeah, so far so good! Okay, got intense. It's intense now, baby. 
I'm asking for Nintendo money for Christmas. I feel you. I me too. <laughs> me too. Aka top of my list. Yeah, love that. Love that. This one's cool. I'm not big on platformers, but I like how this one looks. It's giving me like it, I didn't think it was gonna give me weird little unicorn creature, but I love it. Love that for them. Love that for them. I like the music. What's your guys' favorite type of game? Are you guys really into platformers? Are you into like farming sims? Are you into like RPG? What are you into? What are you into? It looks good, it has good graphics. Yeah, I like how it looks. The characters look fun. This game? Pepper grinder. Yes, so can pepper. This spicy drill wielding treasure hunter. Spicy. Has been shipwrecked and robbed. Now, Farming sense for sure me too. Spin up her RPGs like Mass Effect and Dragon Age. Farming sense in RPGs. Through the I've gotten away from platformers, but these are cute. Maneuvers. Ever since um, Lonesome Village, I'm like, do I like puzzles? <laughs> I'm like, do I like puzzle games? <laughs> I kind of like puzzles too, I think now. Hyperceptive pigeon platformers and RPGs. We have a nice mix. Lots of farming people. If you watch me, you probably like farming. <laughs> Farm sim, life sim, RPGs, yep. Yeah. Building decorating, yeah. I like how this one looks. It's cute. If you like Lonesome Village, you should really try Breath of the Wild. I've played a little bit of Breath of the Wild. I think it's I've heard about Coffee Talk. I never played the first one, but it looks really cute. Coffee Brewing narrative driven visual novel is back for a second episode. Well, As hello. the barista of your own late night coffee shop, meet quirky characters. He's got listen horns. To their heartfelt stories. He's got and horns. Get to know them. Does it say, one cup at did a it say Tamagotchi? All while enjoying the cozy lo fi soundtrack. We love a Not cozy lo-fi soundtrack. Oh, we love a lo-fi lo lo soundtrack. Loved Coffee Talk when I played games, it. Yeah, I've heard about this one. Fantastical regulars. I don't. I haven't really played that many like narrative right games. I feel like I would like it though. I'm, I'm a player. It. Latte art I'm a player. <gasps> and Latte art. Secret recipes that are sure to warm their heart. That's cute. Relax and stay a while. I like that one. Coffee Talk episode two. Hibiscus, Hibiscus and, butterfly. and Butterfly. That's not a cute name. Onto Nintendo Switch. Pours onto Nintendo Switch, cause it's coffee. Did you know it's about coffee? Is this giving us horse girl energy? What is this? Okay, no. Oh, but this is cute. What is this? What's the little ghosty boy? I like the music. What is this? This is giving like cute little open world. I like it. I don't know if I'd want to be a barista outside of being a barista. Maybe it would be like cathartic in some kind of way. I like how these characters look. They look really cute. Very pretty music. Yeah, the vibes are very immaculate. Oni. Oni. Road to be the mightiest Oni. Cute. Cute. Take on the role of a vengeful demon warrior. In a this demon warrior, hot. action adventure. After his defeat at the hands of a Japanese folktale hero, I like the little Kuta ghost baby. to a small island where he joins forces with the spirit Kazemaru. I love Ancient him. He's my favorite. Lurk within vast meadows and lush forests. To defeat them, you'll control. I like this little monster baby. He's a big monster using baby. A single Joy-Con controller. Single Joy-Con controller. To attack demons, then summon Kazemaru to draw out their spirit. You don't need two. But beware. Some demons are invincible, leaving <gasps> you with no other choice. I like that one. Can I be his friend? Can I just want to be his friend. <laughs> his and become the most powerful demon? Begin your quest in Oni. Road to be the mighty Oni. When it like comes Demon to Slayer, Nintendo but with Zelda Breath of the Wild 9, feeling. 2023. It's cute. I like it. Oh, what's this? What is this? It's colorful and I like it. Are we playing dodgeball? What are we doing? What is this? Is it a dance game or is it a dodgeball game? What is this? This is a dodgeball game for sure. I'm bad at dodgeball. Dodgeball scares me, but this looks cool. It looks cool. It's dance ball, perfect. If I have to get up and be active, count me out. 
Desta, the memories between. Okay, is it not Dodgeball Simulator? From the creators of Monument Valley comes a character-driven, roguelite, metaphorical ball game? Oh. Every night when Desta falls asleep, they enter okay, a mysterious so narrative. dream world filled with scattered memories of long forgotten locations. Okay, not what I was expecting from, from that trailer. By, and yes, powerful orbs for playing a surreal turn-based ball game. Okay. Use the orbs to That's pull off cool. perfect throws, shoot sneaky trick shots. My PE class hated each other, so dodgeball was brutal. Oh, I bet. As the night progresses, I really like the art style of this one. into a sweet slumber. You'll unlock new abilities and ways to overcome challenges. Interesting. You'll also meet a cast of colorful characters along the way. I like the little lady with the with glasses. Full voice cast. I'm not sure I can keep up. A oh yeah, look, a non-binary character. Desta, I love that. I like that they include between, their pronouns. Launches on Nintendo Switch early 2023. Early next year. Wow, now was I now what I was expecting from that first little snippet of it. What's this? Uh, young love. Young Going love. The movies. I love young love. School, using supernatural mind reading powers. Yeah. Wait, oh. What? Yep. Hot. This slice of life pixel art the space game has for the unbound. All. Set in 90s rural Indonesia. It oh. High school sweethearts Atma and Raya. I love it in the 90s. Self discovery. However, Dating sim? When a mysterious power suddenly threatens their okay, existence, cat, dragon monster. they must scour their vibrant little town in search of answers. This one looks Talking, cute, too. Diving into the minds of the townsfolk to uncover The colors are very pretty, yeah. Can Atma and Raya face the end of the world? Find out when a space for the Unbound launches on Nintendo Switch. That January one's not too far 19, away, too. 2023. Cute. I want to read people's minds. What's this? Pic oh, what is this? What is this? Watercolor picnics. <gasps> is it like a picture game? I love these stupid games. <laughs> I don't know why I like the picture games. Is it a picture game or is it not? How do you say that? Door. Oh, God. Tell me how to say it. How do I say it? Bonjour. Bonjour. Je suis Cédric Babouche du studio Un Je Ne Sais Quoi et directeur artistique de Dordogne. Dordogne, Dordogne, Dordogne goes to Dordogne. Oh, I can't say it like you do. You have a beautiful accent. Une qu'elle a mystérieusement oubliée. Quand j'étais enfant, je me souviens que l'été était synonyme d'indépendance et d'exploration. Oh, I like Dordogne. Un moment magique Got it. où chaque jour était la promesse d'une nouvelle aventure. It looks so nice. I love the watercolor. À travers le parcours de Mimi. Pokemon Snap Band, you're definitely getting this. Because I played Penko Park and I was like, oh, I love this. <laughs> wow, look at all of the art behind, behind them. Wow. Look at these landscapes. Ooh la la. Ooh la la. Meet Mimi. Wow. As a child, she spent all of her summers here. <gasps> Look at that. Now I want to go to, to there. Her grandmother's home to find that she's left behind a series of Okay, so it's not just pictures. Lost family secrets for Mimi to uncover. Revisit Mimi's childhood memories and help her reconnect with the inquisitive girl she once was. I love Play this both in the one. Past and the present. Skip along the picturesque French countryside wow. as world Mimi while exploring her grandmother's house in the present. Discover That's kind of cool. You're flashing between back between when you were a kid and, and now, now you're an adult. You collect photos, objects, and words. Yeah, okay, so not Use just photos. Use to fill Mimi's journal and keep her precious memories alive. Oh, Dordogne this is so sweet. Travels onto the I love Nintendo this. Switch system next spring. I love that. That looks amazing. Puzzle and a picture stack game. Barely what the heck is this? Alive. Shut up. Shut up. Don't worry. Shut up. You don't need a Botany Manor, where's Jen? Where's Jen? As Someone wake Jen up. Green, you're a retired botanist who has a grand Shut up. manor all to yourself. Shut up. No. Take care of its magnificent gardens by solving plant-based puzzles. Shut up. Plant-based puzzles? <laughs> Shut up. Unearth seeds. I'm in. <laughs> My whole personality's plants. I love that. Mine wants to be, but I can't keep them alive. But I can in this one. Inspect the manor for clues, newspaper clippings, letters, and more I love it. to help your gardening <laughs> skills blossom. While learning more about Arabella, I love this this Stop house we live in. Flowers, 
when Botany Manor blooms onto Nintendo Switch. Okay, the pun. Year. Who wrote the puns? Who wrote the puns for this direct? Whoa, I've heard of this one. This is Theater Kid Simulator. That's not what it's called, but it's like a Theater Kid Simulator. I know this one. Okay, let's go. I want to play this one. You put your own show on. This is my game. I don't remember what it's actually called, but I'm calling it Theater Kid Simulator. <laughs> I like the music. Like, this is my life. You guys you suddenly have a chance to win the contest and perform at the Royal Theatrical Spectacle. The Royal Theatrical Royal Spectacle? Spe the Royal You're gonna stream this, right? I have to. The Royal Once upon a jester, yes. I did hear about this one. Stand down, dragon. You're no match for me. I love a You'll puppet show. You'll never me, prince. Oh, it's a film all. Okay, Wait, theater kid energy, exuding, exuding. Games maken voelt soms als optreden voor ons. Voice acting in. I love these. Can I hang out with them? I want to hang out with these people. Ideeën ter plekke bedenken. Je kan het ook voelen in spel, waar vaak wat je hoort. Theater pay. I know. I'm unleashed. We wilden de spelers dit gevoel van improvisatie geven door ze te laten acteren, zingen en dansen. I like the name too. Once upon a jester. Cute. It's filled with self-made liedjes. I need AJ to play this as well. Oh, for sure. I hope that you'd like something. Oh, it looks so good. You know what? I'm joining a traveling theater troupe. I love this. No, musical theater rules. There have been no misses so far. And Jester are about to discover. They've devised a mysterious scheme to steal a royal diamond. Who's that little fluffy man? Who is the little fluffy Sasquatch man? I love him. The plan hinges on receiving the invitation to join the famous royal theatrical spectacle. I like the sock puppet person. Only the best of the best get invited. The sock puppet person is my favorite. Someone has to improv their way to fame and outperform every other act they encounter on the road. Join them on their wacky, whimsical journey across a fantasy kingdom. Hey, literally, he's a sock puppet. I love him. Sock puppet man. He's my no favorite. The performances are the same. So sing your heart out. That's so funny. And make the stage your own. Once upon a jester, jingle song. <gasps> Stop! It's Can we go play it now? No! What? Available today? Anyone Shut up. Can we go play that now? Classic roguelike game where oh my god. All right. Every playthrough. Whether Jesus. You're uh... with vertigo <laughs> or a vegan chef who fights <laughs> Meat? No, you we're playing alone some village. <laughs> Gather countless riches, build up your castle, and ensure your life. <laughs> Wait, hold on. All Is it on the eShop already? Over to your heirs, Wait, hold on. Each new successor wields Is it on the eShop? Traits and abilities. The Nintendo Switch version also includes I gotta the famous heroes update. Clones of Village tomorrow. I'm not streaming tomorrow. Content. Including dozens of new subclasses and items. No, we gotta do this one at so night. <laughs> we gotta play this new game at night. This game looks spells, cute too. I'm not that into platformers. Avoid it's very cute though. I needed a break after the cozy good. ones back to back. Let me to see, is long this on the eShop yet? Own legacy. Rogue legacy 2 I don't see it yet. On Nintendo Switch later today. They said later today, so. It doesn't look like it's out yet anyway. Buddy up and experience the this one! Of an I love this one! In the co-op adventure, yes. Blanc. Yes! A and a fawn are Give me Blanc! After a sudden snowstorm. This one too. Now, I probably would be the first to stream it. It's not, it doesn't look like it's out yet. As they trek through Maybe the Friday night snowy though. Wilderness, following their family's tracks. Two I love this one. Work together. I don't have friends though. Who's gonna play this with me? Someone will play with me, right? The frosty terrain. Someone will play with me. In addition to simple controls, this game's story and gameplay are both text-free, so anyone oh. can easily immerse themselves in this handcrafted I love that. World. I love the black and white. Start your journey when Blanc steps onto Nintendo. Happy Valentine's Day! Hey, at the end of our 14th, spicy Valentine's Day date, let's play a co-op game about little woodland animals. Hmm? Hot. Can't get Tia, hello. Bindies? Welcome in. Hope Let's you're doing good. Take a look at some more games. Good. I thought you were in. Nintendo Switch I'm already soon. satisfied. I'm already pumped. What's this? What's this? Wrestle Quest. <laughs> All right. Is anyone a pro wrestler fan? All right. Wrestling life sim. Wobble Dogs. I'm playing that. I'm so excited about Wobble Dogs. You make mutant dogs. I'm so excited about Wobble Dogs. 
storyteller. See, I know games. Wait, I do know things. This is cute. I love Wobble Dogs. You'll be seeing that soon on my channel. Literally like next week. This one is a little edgy. The little, the little thing. Curse of the Sea Rats. I feel like I need to play that. All right, Curse of the Sea Rats. Oh, okay, they are rats. Inscription, what's this? Ooh, it's a puzzle game, I like it. I like a puzzle game. Okay, cute. Love that. Show me more. <gasps> ah, I'm, you'll see this on my channel on Friday. Mm. Or tomorrow, no, Friday, it'll be Friday. Um, this is a little to the left. I know games, I guess I do know games. Um, yeah, you'll see this on Friday. I will be playing this one. This is a puzzle game, but it's supposed to be the most like satisfying puzzle game. It's giving kind of like unpacking energy and that like, you know, satisfaction, but you do different things of like putting things back in place. I'm excited, I'm excited about this one. Tomorrow isn't Friday, no, almost, almost. I was very graciously sent a key for this one, so I, oh, and I was excited about it anyway. A little to the left, Hi, I can't I wait. Hi, I'm Lucas. I guess we like to keep things pretty tidy around the house, don't we? Yeah, it can be so satisfying to find the right spot. This one's gonna be so good. Yeah, like I love finding the perfectly sized plastic container to fit leftovers in. That's the best. I like the, what is with the this cat motif? Everybody just has a cat. <laughs> finding satisfying puzzles hidden among household objects. There's yeah, one I saw where you have to like take peel and, uh, peel the stickers off of fruit. Just Sergio, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for being it. slow. He sleeps at Lucas's desk while he's Yeah, the working. cat designed the game. Yeah, and I have to Big type flu. between the tail switches. Yeah. Yeah, this so one is gonna be like really good time wholesome, to satisfying, cozy. Thanks. Yeah, but Can stay you tuned. Move this picture a bit. Yes, a bit to the left. A little bit more. Like that's just. That's it. There you go. Perfect. Wow, you that makes really my soul like feel so nice. Tidy, huh? Just you will feels too, nice. After playing a little to the left, can't wait. A cozy puzzle game where you organize household objects into satisfying. The cat rooms. is a T sitting backwards. It's because we want to move him. Shapes, stack papers, put away the cat toys. Oh, oh I love it. Did I mention there's a cat? I love it. There's hey, a cat. Pause off. This fluffy friend has mischief on their mind and will show up from time to time so to relaxing. make a mess of your beautifully organized This objects. is a re this seems like a but really good worry. like there you're having the most stressful day of your life. To solve. Get home Many of and just have multiple fix solutions. Things. Get home oh, and just and fix yes, things. You can pet the cat. All of these games Me? are on Switch, Mina. A little to the you just bought an on Steam. On yes, Switch later, later today. today. You'll You'll see it on Friday on this channel. And that's it for today. That's it? No! I want more. Is that far? Oh no, there's more. Sorry to okay. cut in, but What's we this? have an update on Sports Story. Sports it's Story? Sports RPG, you'll rise through the ranks of the sports world and prove your prowess. Okay, not for me, but it's cute. And soccer field. There are even more sports in your quest for athletic excellence. Raise your sporting rank to unlock even more discipline. I'm not a sports person. BMS, but you know, uh, mini golf, <laughs> volleyball, cricket, and more. I like how it looks. Then kick back at the mall to relax. The mall's fun. Can I go to the mall? Explore dungeons. That's what right. is this sports this game story? Isn't just about sports. Not just about sports. On a train or helicopter to visit. It's giving me very Stardew energy. Abandoned ruins. But with sports. Mysterious wildlands. Oh, hi. Or pursue your other passions. Make friends with enemies, go fishing. Oh, yeah, what happened to the silk it, game? Poor everybody, you're right. There's so much to do. <gasps> you won't have to you're wait right. long. Sports Story kicks off on the Nintendo Switch system next month. Wow. Is that it, or is there more? And that's, that's it, it. okay. <laughs> wow! Okay, we're gonna go back through it. We're gonna go back through it. I have some thoughts. Cute! Overall, this was really good. This was really good. And as always, Thank you for watching. Thank Don't you. Don't forget to follow our official Twitter account to stay up to date on all the latest news from Indie World. That was quick Until though. next time, happy gaming. They did gaming. say 25 minutes. It's been 25 minutes on the dock. Wow, okay. Initial thoughts. What's the best game? Initial thoughts, what's the best game? We're gonna go back through it for the next several, probably like 20-ish minutes. Um, as we recap before I go into my next stream. Yeah, the Red Panda one. Yeah, I agree. I like that one a lot. 
hold on. Do I need to refresh it and then I can watch it back? It's still live. Let me I let me go back. Let me go back. Right here. That's where it started. Okay. Okay. The first one, a little to the left, I definitely already bought it. Yes. So excited about that one. The watercolor one. Yes, you're right, you're right. So we started with this one, which is I forgot what this one's called. This one's called, I think it's called Venda. Is that what it is? It tells us here. Let me just, I'll play it. I'll mute it. I'll mute it while I talk. I'll just, I'm going to loop it. We're just going to talk as this plays. Okay, so the first one was this cooking, this narrative cooking game um, that features Venda, right? The one that features Indian cuisine, and it's about a family. This one looks really cool. I like the cooking component of it. I saw a little to left on TikTok and wanted it immediately. Should I play that today instead? I was gonna make that into a video. I don't think I have the key yet. I don't think I have the key yet. I don't think I have it yet. I think I have to wait till tomorrow. I actually might. Do we do that instead? <laughs> do we do that instead? I was gonna make it to make it into a video. <laughs> Maybe we play I think I actually do have that. Um we might be able to play it. Um I know I want the Jester one, too. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. So, yeah, this one was really cool. Check the email. Would you want to see that? Would you guys be into that if I played that today instead? Yeah, I do have it. Do I have it? Oh, they gave me, they gave me a PC key. They gave me a PC key. They didn't give me a Switch key. But we could do that. We could do that. We might do that. Um, okay. Yeah, so we had this one. And this was really cute. Venba. I like it. I'm into it. I'm into it. Then we had this one, which is called Goodbye World. And this one is like a meta... A game about making a game. A game about making a game. Which seems really cute. I like the art style. I like this little retro bit, though I will be playing it as well. So maybe a video will be perfect so that you don't have to show all the puzzles. I'll make a poll. Maybe I'll make a poll. I'll check too after we go through all of this. Let me see if the Jester one is out too. Is that the one you think you could play for a full stream? I think there's a couple hours of gameplay. I don't know. I'll look into it. <laughs> I probably will end this stream a little bit before one so I can give myself a few minutes and then we'll see. This one looked cute. This one is called, like, something death. Have a nice death. This one's cute. I'm not a big platformer one, but if I if I did play a platformer, this one seems like a fun one. I like that it's death-themed. All five games I want are out November, December, so that's actually great. Yeah. You might find it a bit repetitive to do for hours. Yeah. Maybe we will just save it for the video. It's supposed to be fr Friday's video, so... That might work. That might work. We'll still play Lonesome Village. And then that Jester game. I want to play that too. I want to play that too. All right. What was after this? Oh, the Red Panda one. This one's called Akka. And this is... I don't know what my favorite one is. Definitely this is a contender for the best one. I'd be here for you playing the Jester game today. I didn't see it on the eShop yet. I'll check again, but I didn't see it. Also, the art style of this one, what are the um, the developers of this one? Is this the, the same people that just made Flying Neko Delivery? Because in Flying Neko Delivery, there is a red panda called Akka. What are your guys' names again? Wait, I want to just see really quick. What are your names? Um, let me just see if it's, it's the same people or just similar. Mm, no, it's a different it's a different developer. But there's a cute red panda and flying Neko delivery too. But this one, this one I think, this one looks like a party. This one looks like a good time. I like this one. This one looked really cute. Um, it's kind of like open world, 
a little farm farmy, a little adventure-y. It looks gorgeous. Like, that's... Yeah, this one is definitely one of my favorites, for sure. This one was really cute. I'm excited about this one. I like it. I like it, I like it, I like it. Um, what was after this one? It was this one, which is another platformer. This one was called, like, Pepper... Pepper? Pepper Grinder? Grinder pe Pepper? Pepper Grinder? Aka means red. Oh, okay, that's why. I was gonna say, I'm like, maybe it's something that I'm not getting. That makes sense, that makes sense. Yeah, this one looks cute. Again, I'm not super big on platformers, but this one looks fun. It looks fun. No hate there. Even the, like, the games that aren't, like, genres that I usually am kind of into, nothing looks bad. Everything looks really cute. Then we have Coffee Talk 2, which I didn't play Coffee Talk 1, but I heard about it. And this one seems cool. It's like a narrative game, but you can also make coffee art, which is cool. Haven't found the Jester one in the eShop either. I know, and I'm like, oh, what the heck? The heck? I feel like the Jester game might be a really good party for, like, a nighttime stream, though. That might be a fun nighttime party. <laughs> but yeah, this one looks cool. I feel like, I wonder if you need to play the first one to enjoy the second one, or if it's a standalone kind of thing, though. And then what? This one! This one that's giving, like, Breath of the Wild energy. This one was called Oni. I like this one, too! This one is, like, another kind of open-world cozy thing. Fin I need to finish the first one. Maybe I should try the first one. Yeah, this one looked cool. I, this one was nice. Mod night. We vibing. Not tonight. I can't tonight, it, but I would have thought it would be standalone. I imagine it probably is. Yeah, this one looks cool. I like this one. Oni. Cool. Great. Love it. But then it started to get extra spicy. Oh, no, not yet. Okay, well, there's this one, too. This one, Desta... This one was a little deceiving, because at first I thought it was going to be a dodgeball game, but instead, it's like a narrative, puzzly, unlocking memories, but also you can play this game of dodgeball, kind of, <laughs> which seems really interesting, and it looks kind of cool, but wasn't what I was expecting from the initial little snippet they showed. Did I ever play Monument Valley? I have not. Pain, have you ever played Monster Prom? I have not. I have not. I have not. This game looks a little empty. Which one? This one or the coffee one? Or the, um, Oni one? Yeah, this one looks cool. Interesting. Interesting. Oni? It does feel very open. It feels very open for sure. Then there was this one, which I don't remember the name of. Uh, what is the name of this one? Wait. This was the one about, like, young love, but also mind control. <laughs> um, a space for the unbound. It's young love, but mind control. I like this one. It looks good. Payton, have you been playing Mario and the Rabbit Sparks of Hope? No, I'm not a big Rabbits person. I was really scared of them as a kid, and as an adult, I just haven't played it. <laughs> Is it good, though? Is it good? I haven't, pl I haven't played it. I had a very irrational fear of the rabbits growing up, and then I just never, as an adult, been like, hey, Peyton, you're probably not scared of those anymore. You should probably, like, try those games. I didn't like them growing up. I was like, ooh, what are these creepy little rabbits? I wasn't into that. This one! This is the best one. This is the best. Is this the best one? I don't know. Visually, this is the best one. This game looks insane in the best way. It looks so cute. It looks so wholesome. I don't remember what it's called, but they'll they'll tell us. Um, it's like pixely, puzzly game. Pix picture. Oh, right. This one. Got it. Um, it's like pictures, puzzle, narrative, unlocking memories. It looks beautiful, but sad. Yeah. But I'm kind of into it. But I'm kind of into it. I'm kind of into it. And then after that... I think things continued. Oh, yeah. After this one, we have the botany one. The, like, the botany manor. The one that I can't pronounce right. You all told me, but I, I cannot remember phonetically how you... Dogani? 
was it dog i don't know you told me you all told me and i forgot already i like it though and then there's this one which is the botany one um which i like this is cute you live in like a fancy manor door dogney door dogney got it i got it <laughs> i've got it i've got it i got you thank you curry yeah so many good ones this one looks fun i like this botany manor botany manor i liked that one that one was good and then then we all we lost our mind when we saw this we lost our mind about this one which is called once upon a jester and your theater kid realness this is what i want to be playing um right now but it's and it releases today but as of me checking the eShop at the current moment, I do not see it. Um, but it looks really fun because you get to improv and make jokes and there's a sock puppet person. You know? There's a little sock puppet person. Iceland. This game looks... It's gonna be so unhinged. I love it. What are you called? Once I'm typing it in. Once upon a jester. Take my money. I don't know how much any of these games are, mind you. I don't even see it in the eShop. Like, if you type it in, I don't even see, like, a coming soon. I don't even see it coming soon. Don't even see that. At almost 30, I didn't think I'd be so excited about this game. I feel ya. But also, it makes sense. Also, for me, I'm a little weirdo. Yeah, it's gonna be out later today. It is not even listed on the eShop yet. But I believe it'll happen. Then we had this one, which I frankly wasn't paying much attention to because i was so excited about the last three games are you gonna play my fantastic ranch i don't know that one my fantastic ranch what's that one i'm thinking it's 12 pst that it's gonna be released oh well that's a while for us just a couple more hours well <laughs> it's fine um Y'all better be at my stream playing it on Friday, I guess. <laughs> if I play it on Friday. Um, yeah, this one looked fine. I'm not a big platformer, as I said before, but I like it. It looks cool. I wasn't paying attention, though, because I was really excited about the previous ones. Then, we had Blanc. It comes out on 11-17. It looks like a farm sim with unicorns. Shut up. What? <laughs> farm sim with unicorns? What do you mean? Stop stop what do you mean i love that i like blanc blanc looks good the only thing is i i wonder if you can play co-op online because i don't think i can convince my boyfriend to play this with me and he's the only other irl person i have access to but if you can do online play then this is really great i'm sure you can i'm sure you're gonna be able to i like that it comes on valentine's day too by the way 10k v day so no alex only shows his voice at 10k then hi pre-orders begin later today for this one good to know then we got the quick little summary of these so we saw oh my god i'm so excited about wobble dogs okay wait so we got um the wrestling one chicory is a colorful tale oh, super fun you'd love it i'll look into it i've never heard of it this is WrestleQuest. It's not for me, but it is for someone. It looks cool. It looks cool, though. You know? Wobble Dogs! I'm so excited about Wobble Dogs! Okay, um, Wobble Dogs... So exciting. Because you get to make mutant dogs. You get to, you get to make mutant dogs yeah this one i know i will be playing they also very kindly sent me a key so i will also be you'll you'll see this one as well you'll see this one as well this one into a, a little to the left you will see you will see um shout out to the lovely people for helping me save my money because <laughs> i will buy all the dogs anyway i'll buy all the dogs i'll buy all the games anyway um and then yeah we had this like collection these all look cool they all look different this seems like a very narrative thing. It seems like something cuckoo is going on. Interesting. Looks interesting. Then there was the sea rats, which I have some triggering history with rats, but this does look cute. I like how it looks. They're little sea rats. Then there was this one. 
which I kind of like. It looks like a spooky puzzle game. It looks like a spooky puzzle game. I'm kind of into that. And then... A Little to the Left. Love it. One of the best ones. This is going to be great. This is going to be so satisfying. This is how I'm going to unwind after a long day. I'm going to like... Okay, let me sort my batteries now. <laughs> let me sort my packages now. Uh, can't wait for that. That's going to be great. Pippa, hello, welcome in. Hope you're doing so good. Wobble Dogs is my most hyped. It's going to be so good. I can't wait. Can't wait. Can't wait. It's going to be great. So yeah, a little to the left looked great. And then I think the only other one was the sport one, right? This one, which is Stardew Valley, but sports. Stardew Valley, but sports, but you're playing sports. So. If we can't get Nintendo dogs, we'll take the mutant dogs. I, that's all I'm saying. I agree. I agree. I happen to agree with you. Happen to agree with you. Yeah, if you guys haven't already liked today's stream, I would appreciate that so very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, we're about to wrap it up because it looks like we just went through everything. Yeah, that was all the games. Okay, um. Recaps, thoughts. Okay, the games I'm most excited about here, Akka, the red panda one, I am excited about the watercolor one, I'm excited about Wobble Dogs and a little to the left, the theater kid one, I love, um, the botany one and the cooking one look really good too, um, Blanc looks good if I can make friends, they're like good. Good! Solid! We- did we get what we wanted? I think we did. I wanted something cozy. Something cozy. There were many options. I wanted something sad. The memory one seems a little sad. And the cooking one, too. Seems like it could have some, like, sadness in it. Wanted something sad. I wanted something weird. The theater geek one and the mutant dogs. Those were freaking weird. And I love them. Once Upon a Jester's live? Shut up. No, it's not. Stop. Don't tempt me. What if I play it in 10 minutes? <laughs> what if I play it right now? Um, I gotta bust out a new thumbnail then. Stop, stop, stop. You're lying to me. Stop, 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 stop. Hold on, hold on. If I can see this in my eShop, I'm gonna scream. It's still not there! It's not there! It says no results! Maybe I need to exit? <laughs> Can you all my heart please play? I gotta make a new thumbnail! <laughs> it's fine. I'll, you'll see the same reaction face that's from another one. Refresh it? Okay, hold on. Let me go to recent releases first. Just, just see if it's there. Okay, it's not. I want the Jester game. I'm just going to type in Jester. Where are you? Where are you? No, it's not there. You posted the link? Hold on. Go to site. Okay, hold on. Yeah, why the heck is it not showing up on my Switch? I'm going to buy it right now. Hold on. Am I signed into this Switch? I am. I am. Hold on. Hold on. Take my money. Let me download you. <laughs> what are we doing? <laughs> oh, what are we doing? Ah, oh, it's not letting me buy it still. It's not even letting me buy it. I want to buy your game. I'm really excited about it. <laughs> did you close the store and then access it again? I did. You might have to restart your Switch. I could do that. Hold on, I could do that. I could redo that. I could do that. Hold on. It'd be fine if I could just get it online, too. Okay, hold on. Take my money! Yeah, when I try and buy it on the website, it's, like, not... Letting me click the button. Guys, I'm trying. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do, guys. Let me try to open this one more time. 
The stream might need to start at like 1.15. I might need a few minutes. <laughs> I might need a few minutes. Okay, hold on. I'm glad we're all hyped about this, though. The 65 people here are pumped about this, I think. It's still not there! What do you mean? Nintendo, listen to us. Payton wants to give you her money. I Just take my money. Let me buy your game. Hey, let me buy your game. Let me buy your game. I, I just want to buy the game. Like, it doesn't let me... Hold on. Actually, let me show you. I'll just show you. Oh, you can see my Nightbot, lol. Here, look at this, look at this. Nothing happens! Th nothing happens! I wanna buy it. And my other Switch is dead. I was like, maybe if I open my other Switch? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I think... I'm going to try and figure this out. I think we're going to end this stream here. Um, I'm going to I'm going to try and figure this out. It's not showing on yours either. What the heck? I want to I think I really do want to play this. I think this would look fine. Try the mobile app. I'll try that. So, I am going to I'm not going to redirect you to my stream because I might change the stream. So, I'm supposed to be streaming at 1. I might stream at 1:15 or 1:30. Just give me a little bit. I'm going to attempt to try and play this Once Upon a Jester game. If I can't get it to work, then we're going to go ahead and we're going to just play some more Lonesome Village. But that's what we're going to do. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Thank you all so much for being here. Um, if you haven't already, please like the stream on your way out. And comment in the actual comments of the stream what game you're most excited about. Um, I want to know. Um, I'm not going to raid because I am going to be back in like 10 to 30 minutes. And yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Thank you so much for being here. All the love in the world. And I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.